Hello, and welcome to the Daily Orthodox Christian Scripture reading for the 16th Sunday after Pentecost. The first reading of the day is from St. Paul's letter to Titus, chapter 3, verses 8 through 15. Titus, my son, the saying is sure. I desire you to insist on these things, so that those who have believed in God may be careful to apply themselves to good deeds. These are excellent and profitable to men. But avoid stupid controversies, genealogies, dissensions, and quarrels over the law, for they are unprofitable and futile. As for a man who is fractious, after admonishing him once or twice, have nothing more to do with him, knowing that such a person is perverted and sinful. He is self-condemned. When I send Artemis or Tychicus to you, do your best to come to me at Nicopolis, for I have decided to spend the winter there. Do your best to speed Zenos the lawyer and Apollos on their way. See that they lack nothing. And let our people learn to apply themselves to good deeds so as to help cases of urgent need and not to be unfruitful. All who are with me send greeting to you. Greet those who love us in the faith. Grace be with you all. Amen. And today's Gospel reading is from Luke chapter 8, verses 5 through 15. The Lord said this parable, A sower went out to sow his seed, and as he sowed, some fell along the path, and was trodden underfoot, and the birds of the air devoured it. And some fell on the rock, and as it grew up, it withered away, because it had no moisture. And some fell among thorns, and the thorns grew with it and choked it. And some fell into good soil and grew, and yielded a hundredfold. And when his disciples asked him what this parable meant, he said, To you it has been given to know the secrets of the kingdom of God, but for others they are in parables, so that seeing they may not see, and hearing they may not understand. Now the parable is this, The seed is the word of God. The ones along the path are those who have heard. Then the devil comes and takes away the word from their hearts, that they may not believe and be saved. And the ones on the rock are those who, when they hear the word, receive it with joy, but these have no root. They believe for a while, and in time of temptation fall away. And as for what fell among the thorns, they are those who hear. But as they go on their way, they are choked by the cares and riches and pleasures of life, and their fruit does not mature. And as for that in the good soil, they are those who, hearing the word, hold it fast in an honest and good heart, and bring forth fruit with patience. As he said these things, he cried out, He who has ears to hear, let him hear. Thank you for listening. Let the brightness of the Lord our God be upon us, and direct the works of our hands to do good. See you tomorrow.